How's it going everybody? This is Beat the Bush. Today I'm going to show you what it's like to ride in a Waymo. I'm going to go from the very beginning, hail a ride, ride in it, and give you my reaction. Start the app and I'm going to tap the map here. Uh, we need to get to somewhere close to Chinatown. So I'm going to pick this area here, right there. We're kind of near Pier 39 right now. So I'm going to choose here, confirm pickup, request car, double click to pay. Seems like we gotta pay ahead of time. So we gotta go to the pickup point now. It's requesting a car. It's gonna show up in seven minutes. Let's go. I can change the ID from yellow or purple, white. Let's do yellow, okay? We gotta go over there. The car probably will come down this street here. We're here. Let's go. Oh, there's one right there. If it stops here, it's just gonna like block everybody. ubers you know when it says it's arriving it really is arriving but it's been like four four or five minutes since it says it's arriving is that it oh there it is why is there a little skinny thing on top a bunch of sensors here oh that's not mine five line there's another one maybe that one is it that is crazy it's not even driving on the road right okay come on come here come here what if I touch the little spinny thing? You gotta press unlock. Unlock. To get in. Let's get. There's no. There's no driver in here. Wait, are you? How is this happening? Wait, are you gonna get in? Get in. Yeah, Weibo has no driver. Are you sure? Yeah. Push start ride. <laughs> can, can it just sit here? Like, I guess there's no cars behind. Okay. Hello from Waymo. As we get going, just give us one minute to cover a few riding tips. This experience may feel futuristic, but the need to buckle up is the same as always. So keep your seatbelt fastened, please. I need to wear my seatbelt. So please don't touch the steering wheel or pedals during your ride. Arrives in 10 minutes. When it's not moving, it's not so bad. But uh, when I saw the car coming in and it was like kind of swerving left and right a little bit, it kind of makes me nervous. <laughs> it's a little different when you can't take over like in a Tesla. Yeah, right now it's okay. It's gonna do a left turn. <laughs> oh, there's another car. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, okay. There, there's another Waymo in the front. Okay. Uh, I guess it, it goes in the... In, it's gonna go straight. It's driving in the middle of of the road here. It's kind of like playing calm music, trying to calm you. But look, I personally, oh, there's a guy right there. Don't run him off. Oh, geez, don't know. Oh, okay, he's in, he's in the Tesla. Okay, he's gonna turn right over here. Okay, okay, are you, are, don't, don't hit the curb. Don't hit that car. So far it's okay, it's not like, Speeding a lot anyway, it's just kind of like a slow ride, but oh boy Don't touch their wheel it says my hands are like super cold because I'm so nervous <laughs> Why is it driving through like the inner streets and stuff it it kind of feels like Oh, something's happening up there. There's a dog. Oh no. There's a dog. Maybe these Waymos are programmed to go on these less busy streets just in case. Get in, stuck inside a lot of traffic. Because the street it picked us up from is like really dead. There's no cars behind. Okay, it's gonna do a left. Pedestrians.
it's like a thing to do in San Francisco. You know, we see all these people, they're in cars and then they're like taking selfie videos. <laughs> it's a curiosity when there's no driver. Okay. Okay, it's gonna, okay. Obviously, I think they worked out enough bugs that it's not gonna run over anything, but you never know. Okay, there's a car coming over there. It's fairly good, I think. Yeah. This is blinking yellow, so proceed with caution. Okay, gonna turn right. You know, yeah, it's kind of taking it easy. It's not going too fast. Right now it's only 19, 20 miles an hour. So, you know, if you drive slow, you can, you don't, you don't have to, you know, be as careful. Why is it doing this? This is crazy. This is like the weirdest route I've ever seen. I think a taxi driver would never do this, like going uphill. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they almost ran into it. That's really close to the truck. It didn't almost run into it, but like it was like about to, and then it corrected itself. Why is it going up this really steep road? Taxi drivers, normally they would like avoid going up and down hill. It's bad, it's bad for the car. Like if you don't have to, you don't, you shouldn't go up a hill, but okay. Yeah, I don't, okay. We're going to get there very, very soon. Two minutes. <sighs> kind of feels like skydiving. All this adrenaline rushing through. I'm going to get really tired after, after riding this thing. Not bad. Wait, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> what, what, one Waymo sees another. It better not crash into each other. Yeah, okay. Okay, it's gonna turn right. Are, are we getting close? But, oh gosh, it makes me really nervous whenever it's driving over the middle of the road. It does that quite often. See, even right now. Pedestrians go through. I'm glad uh yeah, it won't be my fault if if oh, oh my god Oh my god <laughs> It just cut oh my gosh that that SUV getting, getting close. close Don't let okay. your belongings right that, away grab your stuff now That SUV was in the middle of the intersection and then it turn right right in front of the car and then that lady in there's like what are you doing you idiot pull the handle twice to exit okay we're here pull unlocks pull the handle opens the door pull the handle twice to exit make sure you get your stuff there's a ride waymo yeah There's a little thing in front. Oh, it's, and he's, he's gonna, okay. There he goes. There he goes, it's kind of slow. It's holding up two cars. 